Good morning! Well, for today's video, I thought we could look at some of the DIY pieces that we have here in the warehouse. Um, as you can see, we've got a bunch of furniture. And uh, this is one of the uh, topics that is near and dear to my heart, because uh, I really love furniture design. Um, so uh, yeah, let's start taking a look, because there's a lot of really cool pieces. Um, starting with this one, I thought this was super unique. Um, I love a piece of furniture that has tambour on it, and ta-da, this one does. And actually, in a lot of times, like the old furniture, these um, don't work so well. And uh, I'm happy to report that this one sticks a little bit when it comes out from the side, but otherwise, they move very well. So that's very exciting. Um, yeah, but I love I love that tambour um, door on uh, on that storage space. Uh, it looks like it could could use a few um, pulls. Uh, but yeah, this one looks like it had some really cool features. Um, it looks like it had a rail at one point that's no longer there. Uh, the top has some cool um, veneer design. As you can see, it hits a little bit rough. Uh, but look at the side. It's got a little bit of a painted element on it too. It'd be really neat to uh, restore to keep that or um, it'd look great painted as well. Um, I love the uh, swoops on the edge of the shelf there. And then look at the feet. Kind of like an arrowhead almost. And all four of them like that. And the legs are so nicely tapered. So yeah, really, really cool piece. Uh, it's only 35 bucks. So uh, yeah, perfect for you to uh, add your creative elements to. <laughs> and then next to it, uh, there is a drop down desk. I really love the style of this, really classic. Look at those swooping legs. Can you see them? It's kind of hard with the color, but yeah, look at how they kind of very gracefully slip forward. Yeah, really nice design. I love the bottom of the drawer here. Has a lock, you don't have the key, but um, I think it's a cool uh, decorative element in any case. And then the top, inside the uh, desk, there's some great cubbies, a little drawer. Um, the writing surface could use a little bit of help. <laughs> and also it's missing its hinges, so may need some sort of support as well. But it's only 45 bucks, and uh, yeah, for a really great uh, piece of furniture, just needs a little love. A really good project piece next on the list check out this corner cabinet isn't this awesome i the two things i love most about it are the center piece here that kind of slips out a little bit it's a little bit uh um raised forward from the doors i think that's great and then the hardware i think is fantastic look at these little uh, lozenge style poles and then these on the doors are these great they remind me of pringles a little bit uh, but a uh, super cool um kind of mid-century modern vibe style to them yeah really really cool um great corner piece glass doors for storage there's some plate um grooves in the back uh but yeah you could use it for all sorts of stuff um this is 95 bucks um and this i think i almost feel guilty putting it in the uh um in the diy section <laughs> because I think it's pretty great as it is, but if you don't like that finish, um, you could um, you could update it. Um, and it's 95 bucks, so really great for that as well. And next to it, this um, dresser is pretty awesome. I think it'd make a really great sideboard. I love how the drawers curve towards the edges and make room for these um, columns. The columns are faux painted, as you can see. And they have these great Corinthian uh, capitals to them. I think actually this one here, you could put maybe a, a little bit of refinishing. There's some obvious places where uh, it wasn't intentional, <laughs> but otherwise it's got kind of a nice distress finish to it, if you like that look. Otherwise, um, it's priced at 95 bucks, so another really great one for uh, um, refinishing. Um, the pools are really great as well, although this one looks like it's missing a few elements. Uh, but yeah, look at the wreath style. Really neat. So yeah, I can't remember if I told you, 95 bucks for that. Um, yeah, just a really cool piece. This one here is a blank canvas, I think. Uh, 55 bucks. Uh, it would look great painted, I think. Or hey, if you like this um, color, you're set. Uh, but yeah, nice tall dresser, some uh, storage, 55 bucks. Can't beat it. Then next to it, really classic sideboard, isn't it? Man, I think part of what gives it that look is the uh, really great hardware. I think these are beautiful. Um, I love the uh, little panel design on the doors. And then the slight curve to the front of the drawers. I'm just a huge fan of curved drawers. I think they're uh, incredibly elegant. So and this is also $95. Um, it could use like a refresh 
on the finish as you can see there's some scratches on the top but um you could i'm not sure you have to paint it you could um keep it the same color but of course you could paint it if that's the look you enjoy um so yeah great sideboard and then we'll give you a slow overview of the furniture section as we go to a few more pieces um this one i don't put in the in the uh, diy category i think it's fantastic as is but i wanted to point out i love the curve here look at that isn't that elegant how it just kind of swoops out at that little joint and then how the leg continues the curve down to the foot really pretty i also really love the hardware um this one i would not put it's a 145 uh, you could update it with paint if you want, but man, I think it's fantastic as is. Um, so pretend it's another video that is not DIY and then this one is in there. I couldn't resist showing you just because of, of that curve. Um, the last one I want to show you is this one here. Um, this one would have so many great features. I mean, notably, I think it would make an awesome uh, TV stand. Uh, it's a good height for that, it seems. Um, you could paint it, but I love the color of the veneer. Look at those stripes. Isn't that amazing? And then, of course, as I mentioned, I, I absolutely love curved drawers. This one uh, has very curvy drawers. Pretty fantastic. It is only 10 bucks, so uh, please come and get this. <laughs> this is just a really great, a really great piece. Um, and uh, one thing you may notice, uh, it is missing a little bit of its foot. I love the feet. Check this out, kind of a simplified lion's paw almost. Um, if that depresses you, don't worry. <laughs> we have the extra piece. So yeah, it just needs to be reattached. So that's exciting as well. So yeah, oh, and I forgot to mention, of course, the keyholes, super great. So, so yeah, that is just some of the furniture we have here. Uh, this is um, our kind of overflow furniture section. We have two rooms of furniture over there to check out as well. So uh, yeah, if you're interested in furniture, come visit the warehouse. We're open every day from 12 to 5 p.m. Uh, you can also check out a selection of furniture on our Community Forklift Marketplace. And that is communityforklifemarketplace.org. So, all right, well, if you have any questions about our nonprofit, how you can donate materials or how you can um, purchase materials, uh, please put those, oh, hello. <laughs> please put those questions uh, in the comments and uh, I will um, answer them for you. So, all right, well, thanks a lot for following. I hope you enjoyed the mini tour and uh, have a great day.